So Philadelphia awaits the winner of this matchup. Next to Kevin Egan, I'm Dan Kelly. So good to have you with us. As we see here, the Chicago Fire starting lineup. John Bush, surprisingly enough, gets the nod in the starting lineup tonight ahead of Sean Johnson, who's been on very good form of late. Matt Polster will stay at right back like we saw against Columbus away. Eric Gehrig alongside Addy Elton. Welcome back to Joven Jones at left back. And then in midfield, Patrick Niako on the right, Harry Ship on the left, Watson alongside Cochise in the middle. And delighted to see Sean Maloney back wearing number 10 for the Chicago Fire underneath Jason Johnson. It was a nightmarish performance for Adi Elton last time facing this Orlando City side. So hopefully he seeks a little redemption this evening. This is a look at Adrian Heath's first choice 11. Yeah, Adrian Heath has to be so careful, only being able to play and feature five guys not with national status here in the United States. So Seb Hines, partner Sean St. Ledger in front of Tally Hall. Luke Bowden on the left, Rafa Ramos on the right, and then very reliable pair in Christian Higuita and Darwin Seren in centre midfield. Ribeiro and Avila on the flanks, and Kaká underneath the Canadian international, the man who scored the last day. These teams featured here, Kyle Lahren. The sturdy Scott, Sean Maloney, Kaká and Ribeiro, in Orlando City, in their white shirts on the road, opening up play. This is the 2015 Lamar Hunt U.S. Open Cup quarterfinal. Trying to go keeper to keeper. Patrick Niako, the intervention! Just in time, Patrick Niako make it 1-0 Chicago Fire. Jason Johnson left it. The defence stood still, and Patrick Niako with a clinical finish. And puts the Chicago Fire up nice and early. What a start. Here comes Ramos. In pursuit of ship. Ramos down to Avila. Curling that cross in. In Orlando City. Has leveled the match here. Early in the second half quality attack down the right hand side Ramos lovely little dink from Avila John Bush couldn't get there and between Polster and Gehrig is Kyle Lahren to equalize the match Have to work so hard cut out the supply in central areas force them wide an intelligent press Watson starts this attack here comes David Akam with Igbuananike a calm off the post, Igbuananike, Chicago Fire, late strike, it's Kennedy, and he's flipping out. David Akam, blistering pace on the left-hand side, gets the shot off, very unlucky, quality effort. The inside post, right place, the right time, the man that needed a goal, and as you said, goes flipping out in front of section eight. And sometimes it just falls for you. And right here, Igbonanike couldn't have asked for a better place for the ball to fall. Onto his right foot, the favoured right foot. Ripped in by Saren. Dropping down, Ramos. Well anticipated by Joven Jones over the top. Igbonanike, goodbye Kennedy Igbonanike. Looking for a second, rounds the keeper, make it two for Kennedy Iguananike. Exciting times at Toyota Park as Kennedy Iguananike has secured the trip to PPL Park in Philadelphia for a US Open Cup semi-final. Clinical finish from Iguananike. And Chicago Fire now look destined to be just one match away from a return to a US Open Cup final. He and Matt Watson team up on the seamless clearance. They hear the whistle. Good night, Orlando City. Next stop, semifinals. The Philadelphia Union, thanks to the brace from Kennedy Iguananike. 